I have reviewed Caroline's notes. The New York City Resistance Group is concealed at the top of the State Building. Uh, said I assume the high altitude means the radiation is at tolerable levels? Definitely. <laughs> right. However, we can simply fly in there in our Nazi helicopters because we're gonna be shot down. Can't we re-establish contact then and let them know our helicopters are friendly? I've looked, but I couldn't find any means of contacting them in Caroline's notes. Bloody hell. Well, we'll need to approach from ground level then. Introduce ourselves properly, face to face. Ground level. The whole city is saturated by fallout from the Nazi atom bomb. Lethal levels of radiation if we go there without protective wear. Yeah, with well, this one, look, this armor will shield from all radioactivity. Will you do it then, Blasco? Have you grown too weak and useless now? Always wanted to see the Big Apple. Lovely. Well, by then, drop them off now, eh? No problem, Wing Commander. Can I be of use? What do we know, lass? Can ya? Five degrees pot, Unsan continues, straight forward. Got you, Blondie. Hey, big friend. You better watch out for the crocodiles. Crocodiles. It's not New York underground crawling with crocodiles. Oh no, I'm from Texas. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Blasco, find your way through the bombed out city and reach the state building. Faster the better. Fergus out.
building. Caroline, will you help light the way? old train. Nice. Should get to work on upgrading my weapons. Okay, train's got power. Let's find the controls and see if it moves. William, do you read? If you are on 5th Avenue, the State Building should be near.
like my guts are falling out. That man walking. Should get to work on upgrading my weapons. Find a way to reach the top of the state building and make contact with the resistance group. Look for elevators, stairs, anything. The radiation levels should be acceptable at the top of the building. Your voice, Anya. Every second, a glory.
Absolutely clear that I am not a Nazi. What do you, you say? You say you're a Nazi? No, 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 I am not a Nazi. I'm not a Nazi, okay? If you ain't a white ass fascist Nazi pig, then you're either colored or you're a deviant. Are you sure as hell ain't colored? So you trying to pass as a deviant? You look like a deviant to you, Sister Grace? Nope. Hang on, hang on. I may not be a deviant. God, I told you, you that goddamn Nazi! Oh, fuck this. Oh, fucker! Let me say this again. I ain't no goddamn Nazi. Hey! Now you bring Super Special back in and you put him down right now, or I will shove this grenade so far up your ass, I'll be dancing and rejoicing as your entrails trickle down from the ceiling. You dig, man? Lady, I got precious little time for your bullshit. We've been trying to make contact with your group. We're organizing for a revolution in America. We? The Chrysal Circle. 
Especially escort this motherfucker inside the house and get him a hot meal. Let me put this pen back in. Shit! Take cover! <laughs> Relax, man. He's just a duck. Oh, he's got a sick sense of humor. Uh, dude, you're crushing me. Oh, oh. Chili, okay? It's my papa's recipe. Ain't got no spoon, though. Oh, thanks. So what's, uh, with the chicken fence? Chicken <laughs> That's That's my Faraday cage, man. You, you dig? It, it keeps the, the Nazi alien conspiracy from finding us. I almost got killed by William goddamn Blaskowitz. Do you mind? You were here when the bomb hit. Yeah, I was. I survived relatively unscathed because I was on the ground at the time when I came up. Looked like a vision out of Dante's Inferno, you know what I'm saying? I remember main people just wandering through the smoke. I remember screams that went through the bombed out buildings like howling ghosts. And I remember this mother and son. This boy was blindly stumbling through the chaos. His arms were outstretched, calling out for his mama. And the heat from the bomb had melted the skin on his arms and they just drooped. Like he was wearing a shirt that was a couple of sizes too big. And I remember his mama. She was crawling to get to him. And the half of her body was all gone. It was just gone. What are you thinking in a moment like that? When you know you're losing everything you love. What are you thinking in a moment like that, huh? Shit. That's gonna leave a mark. Monsters did this. Not monsters. Men. Look, I'm sorry for your loss, Mr. Blaskowitz. Before little I spoke with Caroline, she seemed like a hell of a woman. She had balls of steel. Balls. Now why is it that balls are always used as some fucking default definition of badassery? Small, little, delicate things. Resting all snug and warm and cozy and comfortable in their little wrinkly wrapper of fucking skin. Shit. <laughs> that is a mystery. <laughs> What's not a mystery is the sweet juice they produce. Yeah, I got, I got a couple of my own on the way. Cute little guy. It's a girl. Oh, sorry. <laughs> what are you sorry for? What's up, Special? There's pigs, lots of them coming up the stairs. They're gonna fucking army. Shh, the fuckers found us. Well, you got an escape strategy, Mr. Blaskowitz? Anya. We're gonna need immediate evac. Understood, William. Dispatching has one and has two for immediate extraction. Copy. Move your people to the roof. I'll stall the Nazis until our ride's here. Brothers and sisters, listen up! I need everybody to get up to the roof now. We're evacuating. And bring all the equipment you can carry. Come on, let's hustle, people! Come on, come on. Get your shit. You cool? Just make sure your people make it out. Come and fucking get me, you white-ass fascist Nazi pigs! <laughs> 